Snape. I have seen him play that in the past. He is sticking with the character. It looks like Hero versus Snake, our third unique matchup of the game. And here we are. This Cruncho, it'll be interesting to see how someone plays against a character that like to like to play at a distance as Snake does. Of course, it's going to be a lot different than someone who prefers to rush you down like Choke does. Good job with that Caprez. And the Zaps as well out of neutral. We're seeing him use a lot more of the neutral inside specials. But that being said, he is only slightly in the lead. He is just goes to Ops for the heal. Uh, that's a good... I don't know what any of these options are. Goes for the Kaboom as well. That's going to blow himself up a little bit, although does not take any damage. Up tilt. Just didn't like any of those options and just chose to shield cancel and cancel like that forward air as well. I've been saying, and now how we get back, he won't, just misses the tech entirely. Saladin, stock down, Cruncho, unrelenting, just goes for the down throw right away. That frizz as well, although the forward tilt from Saladin now, and then Nikita. It's going to be difficult to seeing to be seeing what Cruncho's recovery patterns look like. And of course, knowing that is so essential for any Nikita. Game. Gets back with the swoosh. That up air will connect. Uses that opportunity. Wow, and I didn't think that would kill. He just goes for the heal instead. Uh, that forward air is powerful. And as powerful as bounce is and as situationally useful, when Snake is two feet in front of your face, bounce probably not the move to go for as that forward tilt will take him out. Down throw into forward air as well. Just didn't get the correct DI. Anymore. A couple of aerials. Didn't like any of the down B options. Cruncho, but he's playing very well. Uh, a stock and a half ahead. Kaboom won't make contact, but no matter that aerial and the dash attack will get him just as he's willing to grab the ledge. Cruncho, by far the most solid uh, game from a hero player I think we've seen on stream thus far. Just over two minutes it took to erase three of a very heavy character stocks, so that has to be certainly very encouraging for Cruncho. I'm not sure if he's just going to give up Joker uh, immediately, although it's it's day one for a hero, so he'll just be having fun. Just gonna go for eight as well. As far as the character pick goes, and we do see the counter pick to Ryu from Saladin. Just didn't like playing from a distance at all against that character, so Ryu opting to go for a much closer approach. Accelerado from Cruncho will lead to him outspacing and getting a quick rapid jab. That rapid jab does 12%, so it's pretty middling in terms of other characters, but certainly a useful option. It does have decent range. That Kefriz has excellent range, and he already has time to charge up another forward throw. Goes for the snooze as well. Just did that too early. Solid opting to go for the down tilt. Although that tilt was with entirely. I like the decision from Cruncho to just charge up the frizz as well, instead of just cycling through some of these command selections. You know, you can go for a lot of these riskier down beams when you're in a deficit, but when you're 60-80% ahead, there's no sense in doing that. Psych up coming out, and now Sally is well aware of that, just going for the up instead of instead of just going for a quick counter. Nevertheless, that Kefriz on Cruncho's part is meant to see all stock one, gets the focus. And that up special, that sure you can on Saladin, that's gonna be eternally powerful no matter the patch. Once again, we see the bounce. Uh, it might be useful against the Hadoukens, but who knows uh, how much viability it will have in the Ryu matchup. Probably not meant much, I'm guessing. That frizzle just going right past him on the iframes and the up tilt. Although that clashes with the focus. So again, that up up air not going to be enough to just directly take him out of it. 
Front shows edge guarding, you know, a bit improvisational, but what isn't with this character? Back throw, uh, goes to the oomph as well, so he'll have additional damage from the time being. Gets the Kafriz as well, that fully charged side spe uh, neutral special, rather, just so, so powerful from what we've seen in our first set so far. Another one coming out there, although he is low on MP, so he'll be looking to just go in, use some of his normal attacks, and either, you know, land some of these spaced aerials, or through some of his defensive play, you know, get the MP needed to just go back. Oh, the up B from Saladin, once again, bringing this to one stock of these down throw from Trunchou. And another Kafriz, interesting. It will kill very early. Very early and very often. Cruncho, the solid 2-0 against a Snake and Ryu. And this character, you know, I'm I'm liking what I'm seeing.